Wolfram Stadium, which has so much history, so many memories for Watford supporters. <laughs> I'm Mike Raggett, long-time uh, season ticket holder at Watford, one of a team that's been putting together the celebrations for 100 years at Vicarage Road. It's been delving into a history, some of which I know, much of which is way beyond even my great age. Uh, so it, it's been fabulous to see how the stadium's developed, to see the, the way we've been able to use stills and video footage in the videos that we're making and so on. It just brought the whole history of it to life and, and makes it into a living stadium that still has that sand pit that opened up sinkholes in the middle of the pitch down below it. It's um, obviously been filled in and nice and stable now, but there, there are great pictures in the book. How important is it we celebrate this as well? It's immensely important. We've been in this location in the middle of town for 100 years. It's really, really important that, that uh, this should be properly celebrated. And it has been and will continue to be for the rest of this year and probably way beyond that. It's a massive occasion for, for the club. 100 year anniversary at that, our ground. Um, many, many good memories here. I'm, I'm proud to be a part of the, a small part of the club's history and, and the history of Vicarage Road and I'm sure it'll be a special night. How important is it that we, that we do celebrate though, like occasions like this, you know? You've played for some big clubs, but I mean the history of 100 years is a milestone, isn't it? Yeah, definitely, yeah, and it's a nice, nice touch the club have uh, I think invited a player from every promotion um, they've been involved in. I've just met a couple of ex-players who were 89 in their 80s. Uh, we're obviously playing in a one-off kit that's been specially designed for the 100-year anniversary, and, and I'm sure there's a bit be a bit of a show tonight, and I hope, hopefully that's capped off with a win. I loved it every time I, I run across this white line here. It was always a pleasurable experience, certainly at the start of the game. Maybe not always when you came, came off, but. The midweek fixtures here under the floodlight at, at Vicarage Road were, were always a little bit special. Played here for, I think, nine, nine seasons, or a part of nine seasons, seasons, so an awful long time, a lot of good memories. I think the relief at the final whistle of the playoffs when the season finally finished and we, we'd achieved a, a promotion playoff uh, opportunity was always special. And then to go on and win through the playoffs, celebrating two promotions on the trot, we did it from here and then we went on to open top buses, but everything based here and that was the way that Graham Taylor always did it. So an awful lot of happy memories, difficult to pick out one or two, but I had a fabulous time here and continued to do so in my ambassador role. 100 years, Vicarage Road, um, it's a special moment. It's a special moment for our supporters, a special moment for everyone connected to the club. And um, there's been some wonderful times here, some great moments over the years and obviously some that I'll remember more recent times. Um, there's a lot of very, very important people in football that have, um, have a lot to do with this club and uh, we need to celebrate those people. And for you as well to have the responsibility to, to manage this club after so much history being in this in this stadium, though, the, the people that have gone before you, how much of a responsibility is that for you? It is a huge responsibility and I, I, I really do feel privileged and honoured to, to be in this role and especially at this moment now. Obviously I know I'm only just in the building and a few games in but I do feel that responsibility. I do feel incredibly privileged and proud to be a part of it, this club. Being here tonight, it's a great atmosphere tonight. It'd be, um, it, it's something to be part of for a um, hundred years. It's, to be part of that, it's just something very special. Um, it's, a bit, it's a weird feeling, really, knowing where it was, and where it is today, and, and potentially where it can be, and what we can achieve. So it's good. What, what are your greatest memories at, at, at this stadium? Obviously, you know, so many over the years, but what, what ranks top? Have, have you got any favourite memories, kids? Just being at the stadium and the yeah. atmosphere. The atmosphere. Dele 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 goal from the corner of the box, straight, straight in the corner, top pin, as I would say. That was my best moment. What would that like? Good stuff. Like, I love it being here. They don't like how special is it to, to be here at the stadium celebrating the 100 years of, of uh, Vicarage? Brilliant! Absolutely amazing. Yes, actual amazing. Let's hope we win. 
10-0 against Mindelsbrad, that's oh. my prediction. Just being here it, with the crowd is just amazing. The players that we brought in over the time and that moment of Troy Deeney scoring that winner here at Vicarage Road was unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. It's just been a pleasure coming to this stadium. Like The thing is with this stadium, you, you love the fans here, just loved and they they want to be here like they want to cheer on their heroes and th this club is something else this club is they want to get behind their players and their fans I say this all the time they're the most important people at any football club you know they've been here before us and they'll be here after us as well so every game not just tonight is for the supporters and um, that's why we want to try and give them something to shout about every week and we've, we've done that at times this year and we know we've got more to do we're going to continue to get better as we, as, we, as we progress and get more more people back and one or two new people that uh, haven't been able to get out on the pitch yet with us as well. Um, but it's all about them. It's all about the supporters, and that's every game, not just tonight. Teams make their way out here on this special night at Vicarage Road, a football stadium which has so much history, so many memories for Watford supporters. And their team give them three points here this evening. Watford will be wearing a special kit to commemorate the occasion, a design styled upon the black and white stripes that they wore here in that very first game at Vicarage Road all those years ago. Together successful seasons. Here is Giles, hands a great delivery. Oh, the the lead. So to this touchline, and McNair easily skipped by it. Pedro. Real chance here for his minor side. Please put your hands together for John Fairbrother. Wizard on the wing is Stuart Scullion. I mean, it's brilliant. It's, I think, something the club do very well. Uh, they've, we've honoured this evening uh, very, in a very classy way with the, the kit and the corner flags and inviting some previous le legends back. And, and it's something that club has done and always will. Um, respect its history in a very classy way. Had Rodrigo got underneath it more. Al Jao Pedro brilliantly brought down. Mario Gaspar onto his left foot, doesn't catch it cleanly. Breaks. <laughs> It was a special night, wasn't it, tonight? It was a special night for the football club. Um, I'm really pleased for the supporters. I'm really pleased for everyone connected to the club. And, you know, this was a big night. And um, I'm really pleased that we were able to, 
to win it in, and in the fashion we did in the end I suppose it, it sends everyone home even happier. Yeah, itself, I mean incredible way to celebrate 100 years isn't it? Oh it's absolutely amazing, it's an absolutely amazing environment, um, the fireworks, the audience, the applause in and seeing the old players as well is absolutely amazing to see, just brought back tears in the eyes. My, I, my family's from Watford, um, they used to live on Vicarage Road, um, Liverpool Road sorry, um, and it just brings back so many memories of my dad being here. They're brilliant tonight I think. Brilliant. The, whole, the way they did the whole thing, it was done so tastefully and respectfully. And then to get a win out of it, just it just capped the night off. It was brilliant. Yeah.